Hello Leo, this is the Pretty Coach Oracles here with your Oracle messages for um, the month of May 2021. Um, it's my pleasure to serve you guys in this way. I'm going to go ahead and hop into the reading. All right. Um, we have the sign of Scorpio here or the death card, which is a card of transformation, major transformation, rebirth, changes. Okay. Major upheavals, even endings and also new beginnings but a specifically ending of cycles this is also an energy about researching um spiritual truths or deep truths being um revealed and things like that okay so this is some of the energy that could be surrounding some of you guys at this time and surrounding the events maybe that could play out okay within this month for you all so let's hop into the energy. I do want to go on record again by saying, please, I would recommend you guys go watch all the rest of the signs, not just your sun sign. Go watch the rest of them because I really feel like messages are coming out in every sign for all the other signs. OK, because truthfully, we're all connected. All right. Off my soapbox for a moment. And here was the first card that came out for you. Leo, some of you guys could literally be dealing with a Capricorn or someone who has Capricorn in their chart. OK. Some of you guys could be dealing with the energies of codependency, fear, sexual addictions, okay, drug addictions. Fighting, if you ask me. Obsession. Someone also could be obsessing over you, Leo, or you could be obsessing over another person. OK, we also had the star card that came out as well. So someone could have Aquarius somewhere in their chart to who you're connected to or dealing with. OK, this person who could be obsessed with you could have Aquarius in their chart. OK, let's move. Or this also is the energy of, you know, miracles happening, answer prayers, wish fulfillment as well. OK, so we're going to get into it once. I finish. We also have the Ten of Swords here. So something has come to an end. OK, but there is promise of a new um, beginning with the sun shining a little bit, even though there's some gray clouds. I'm really hearing a revival here. For some reason, I heard revival. So let's go ahead and start clarifying. I want to start with this. Um, I'm really. I, oh. The double energy is important, but I'm going to start with this Ten of Swords. Spirit, what's coming to an end here? For the sign of Leo, what's coming to an end here? Uh, the Ten of Swords could also deal with the energy of self-sabotage, guys. Okay, look at this shit. Just wanted to turn over, so whatever. We got the Emperor here. We got the Temperance, and we got the Ace of Swords. I feel as though there could be an Aries or a Taurus who could be dealing with the Sagittarius who could be getting ready to speak truth to this person. Or maybe the Sagittarius could be getting ready to speak truth to the uh, Aries or Taurus energy. And as a result of speaking this truth, they're going to be cutting out something that's no longer serving them. So it could bring the ending um, or the demise of a relationship or a connection or a partnership, be it, you know, um, business, family wise, friends, romantic partnership. Spirit, what else? What else is going on here with this Ten of Swords energy? A Knight of Pentacles is showing up here. This could have been a very slow death here, or it could have taken some time. Somebody could have been extremely cautious, maybe the Emperor energy here. Yeah, this person was in indecision and indecisiveness before. Because of maybe manipulation of some sort, mental confusion. Somebody was playing mind games could have been. Doesn't matter who it could have been. I'm also seeing with the five of swords here with this ace of swords. I also feel like somebody could be making some type of strategy or plan as well that they could be getting ready to speak about or just act upon period quickly spirit. Why is the devil card here for the sign of Leo? You guys could be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. we got a lot of air here. Sagittarius, like I said, Taurus and or also Libra. We got the Knight 
of swords but in the reverse this is arguing this could also be really rash decisions and actions taken harsh words spoken here possibly either from a Taurus or a Libra energy or just between um, a woman I'm feeling in a male energy there was some arguing here I also am getting the vibe that somebody could feel like a decision that they made. They made it too quickly in regards to someone who they could have strong feelings for with the Empress energy. A person that they see is very attractive. They had a decision to make. They were at a crossroads. And I feel like maybe somebody could have moved in fear rather than faith. Yeah, we got the uh, hangman in reverse. So it's making me feel like this is Pisces energy. But more than that, somebody could have, someone could be enlightened about this, get some insight about that, that they messed up. They moved too quickly. They said something too soon. Yeah, this person was discontent, unhappy, bored, maybe felt like something was missing or someone was missing. I feel like it's that empress. We got the eight of swords and we got the wheel of fortune. So this energy of possibly feeling stuck or bound in bondage mentally or and even physically, maybe due to fear, codependency issues, lies, deceit and stuff like that. That's getting ready to change as well. Spirit, what's it changing to give me? Let's make this next card what this is going to be changing into. Looks like it's going to be a new offer. Leo, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius here. With the Wheel of Fortune, this is also karmic energy here. This is something that's not finished. Or excuse me, something is finished. Someone's coming out of this energy of feeling blocked, of feeling stuck. Maybe because of fear or sadness in their spirit or heaviness in their spirit. Someone's tired of that. So there's going to be a new opportunity presented. Leo, okay. And Leo, someone's going to have some options here. And we got the Knight of Cups. There's going to be an offer made. I feel like for some of you guys, you are the person, the woman or the man of someone's dreams, Leo. And I feel like they're going to literally be overcoming low vibrational energy in order to reach out to you. OK, so I just feel the need to say be compassionate with them. Even though they may have done some really effed up shit to you, be compassionate. All right, Spirit, why is the star card here, please, for the sign of Leo? Again, this could be anywhere in you guys' charts. I just saw the three of pentacles, but I don't know if it was supposed to come out or anything, but it did show itself. So this is could be having something to do with teamwork. For some of you guys, you could become, um, you can meet your soul family. If it's not about your soul family, it's going to be like this real... It's like a family coming together and finally working together for a common goal or friends or romantic partners. Okay. Spirit, give me some more. Wow. Okay. We have the death card coming out again. So this wish fulfillment, this major ass change, like somebody is transforming. And I really feel like it took this death energy, this Scorpio energy, because otherwise somebody may not have changed. I'm seeing three cards here. We have the judgment, the seven of swords and the magician. So this is making me think about a Scorpio energy an Aries, a Libra. And again, with the judgment energy, more Scorpio energy. Ooh, baby. I feel like with this judgment and the seven of swords, I just kind of feel like something was exposed here. Something was spo exposed. Someone spoke the truth. And this is going to end something. Somebody's deception could have been exposed. And this is the appointed time. Spirit, please give me some more for the star card energy, please. Yeah. I'm seeing the queen of cups. Scorpio energy, Cancer, Pisces, but it's time for someone. There's someone that this person really cares about, loves a great deal. A one, like I said, a, a woman of somebody's dreams. Yeah, this person is like I said. Yes, God. Oh my God, ready to work with you. Misses you. Regrets. Um, regrets maybe not marrying you or regrets um not being responsible towards you. 
Leo. Wow, wow, wow. I feel like this person will be reaching out, period. They want to unite with you. They are miserable. This was someone who could have been like a husband figure to you or bare minimum. You guys were in a committed relationship. Taurus energy is here. Capricorn, Virgo energy. I'm also feeling as though uh, if someone if this is uh, indicative of two different relationships here, somebody's decision to possibly reunite with maybe an Aries or something like that could leave a Taurus energy, a Capricorn or a Virgo energy in a lot of sadness, a lot of loss. But I really feel like this was all still connected to this star energy. I feel that this person who's been feeling sad and miserable is a, hu a husband figure. Or bare minimum, someone who you guys shared a life with, okay? At the bottom of the deck, we have the strength card. Leo, that is you showing up in your reading, okay? I really also feel like this person has become stronger. They overcame the devil within themselves. They overcame the devil inside. And, and their confidence is built up. And I feel like it's because they're listening to the divine feminine within themselves. And that divine feminine or their higher self, for that matter, is leading their lower self, the lion, into action. Whew. Somebody got real with themselves, okay? Uh, Leo, that's been your reading. I hope and pray something resonated with you guys. Um, if it did and you'd like to have a private reading, you can... You can select that or order that at the prettycoachoracles.com. You guys have a wonderful rest of your day. Please let me know in the comments how it resonates with you, okay? If you are not already a subscriber and you like just the way that I read and stuff like that, please, please make sure you subscribe to the channel and also hit the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I do a reading, okay? Bye, Leo, and congratulations.